Hello pupils. Today we will talk about hardware and software. It is found on the on page 5 of your book. You can open your book and we shall start. First, the computer is made up of hardware and software. Here it is telling us that our computer consists of both hardware and software. So what is a hardware? Hardware is any part of your computer that you can touch. If you see your computer before you, anything that you can touch is a hardware. For example, can you touch your mouse? Yes, so it is a hardware. Can you touch your monitor? Yes, we can touch it. So, it is also a hardware. Can we touch the speakers? Yes. Can we touch the system unit? Yes. Can we touch the printer? Yes. Can we touch the flat monitor or we can say the LCD monitor? Can we touch it? Yes. Can we touch our keyboard? Yes. So everything that we can touch in the computer, it is a hardware. Now let's look at software. What is a software? Can we touch a software? No, we cannot touch a software. A software is a program that allows us to do our work in our computer. For example, if your computer does not consist of the program windows, you won't be able to use your computer. Same, if your mobile phone does not consist of the program Android, you won't be able to use your mobile phone. If you want to access the internet, you must have a web browser. So, an example of a web browser is Google Chrome or Firefox or we can say Internet Explorer also. Why do we use Microsoft Word? It is a program, it is a software where we can type text, prepare exercises, type letters, anything you want to type, you can do it in Microsoft Word. What can we do with the software Microsoft Paint? We can use it to draw a picture to color, a diagram, anything with pictures, modifying pictures, coloring, you do it in Microsoft Paint. Why do we use Windows Media Player? We use this software to view a video. We want to view a video in our computer. We can use the software Windows Media Player. And why do we use 
AVG antivirus. This is used to protect our computer against virus, against bad programs, or uh, it protects us from opening uh, malicious web pages. If you have a web page where you can get virus on your computer, thus your antivirus program will block it. It will help to protect your computer against the virus. So, let's do a small recap before we work the exercise on page 8. Hardware is something that we can touch, but software we cannot touch. Software is a program that helps us to work in our computer, but hardware is a anything in your computer, is any part of your computer that we can touch with our hand. Now let's move to page 8. We will work the activity together. So let's start working the activity. Activity 1. Circle the hardware and tick the software. So we must circle all the hardware and tick where we find a software. So the first one it is the monitor. Can we touch our monitor? Yes. So it is a hardware. We must circle it. So you take your pencil and you circle the picture monitor. Let's do all for hardware first, then we will do for software. Is Microsoft Word a hardware? Can we touch it? No. So it is not a hardware. Can we touch the mouse? Yes, we can touch our mouse. So it is a hardware. We must circle it. Can we touch the program Windows 7? No. So it is not a hardware. Can we touch the scanner? Yes. If you don't know what is a scanner, a scanner is a hardware that we use to convert a hard copy. Hard copy means anything on the paper. We transfer the content of, of the paper to our computer. For example, if you have, you want that the first page of your book, you want a copy of the first page of your book on your computer like it is, therefore you place the first page on the scanner inside, you place your first page inside the scanner and after that you have scanned the first page, you will be able to see it on the monitor of your computer. Then anything you want to change on it, you can do it. This is why we use a scanner. Can we touch it? 
Yes. So it is a hardware. We must circle it. Can we touch the program? Microsoft Paint? No, we cannot touch it. So it is not a hardware. Can we touch the system unit? Yes, so it is a hardware. Can we touch the program Google Chrome? No, so it is not a hardware. Can we touch the speakers? Yes, so it is a hardware. Where can we touch the program Android? No, so it is not a hard where. After looking at the hardwares, what is left are the software. So we must put a tick over there for software. Microsoft Word is it? Software. Windows 7 is a software. Microsoft Paint is a software. Google Chrome is a software. Android is a software. So I hope you have understood the difference between hardware and software. Thanks for your attention.